A local family says their loved one is recovering in a hospital after a short stay in a county jail. He was picked up by a Burleson County deputy on a public intoxication charge. But what happened after that is what the family is now demanding to know. And after weeks of getting nowhere, they and others held a rally and news conference outside of the jail in Caldwell today. News 3's Whitney Miller was there. Well, this family gathered here today because they say they just want answers. They want to know how their loved one came into jail for a misdemeanor charge and left in critical condition. In April, Chester Jackson Jr. was arrested by the Burleson County Sheriff's Office on a public intoxication charge. After he was released from jail, someone from the Sheriff's Office took him to a medical facility in Austin. When his family finally found him, he was in a coma. They say they don't know how he got that way, and after multiple attempts to get straight answers from the sheriff's office, their questions have gone unanswered. So they said they were going to release him, keep him to Monday. And Monday came, I found out he's in St. Davis in ICU in critical condition. And he still is. I want to know what happened to my child. You know, this family's lawyer says that they have been speaking with the sheriff and that the sheriff says that they are working on getting them the answers they need. For now, in Caldwell, Whitney Miller, News 3. Thanks, Whitney. We also asked the sheriff's office what happened to the 30-year-old from Somerville. A couple weeks ago, a spokeswoman sent us a short email that only confirmed one of their own transported him to that facility in Austin. They did not respond to our request today for more details. We'll have more on this coming up at 10.